George Lansing Raymond was a prominent professor of aesthetic criticism at Princeton University and author of A New System of Aesthetics. He also served as a professor at George Washington University and Williams College. Career, author of A Systematic Theory of Art published by G.P. Putnam, published in seven volumes during the period 1886-1900, to and republished as a set of uniform volumes in 1909. Additionally an eighth volume was published, as a summary of the seven volumes, titled, Essentials of Aesthetics. A volume of excerpts of his seven books, edited by the classical scholar Marion Mills Miller, was also published by Putnam in 1920. Raymond was an art theorist who created the first comprehensive and systematic theory of the arts. The New York Times said, in a spirit at once scientific and that of the true artist, he pierces through the manifestations of art to their sources and shows the relations, intimate and essential, between painting, sculpture, poetry, music, and architecture. He was rarer among art theorists of the time, to use psychology and physiology and biological factors to ground his art theory, and to use detailed discussions of specific artworks to validate his views. His work is neglected, although some scholars say his system deserves resurrection. His basic approach is as stated in his summary one-volume book Essentials of Aesthetics. The phenomena of the arts of the highest class have been traced in this book to their sources in material nature and in the human mind. The different arts have been shown to be developed by exactly similar methods, and these methods have been shown to characterize the entire work of artistic imagination, from the formulation of psychical concepts to that of their most physical expressions in rhythm, proportion and harmony. He was also a vocal advocate of a scientific and rational Christianity. He seemed to be following in Aquinas' footsteps in believing he could rationalize religious belief with science. He was also a widely published poet during the latter part of the 19th century, though with no lasting celebrity. He wrote works on oratory, early in life, since he a professor of oratory, and later in life after retiring from his professorships. He wrote a book on ethics and natural law. Three of his books are available in full digital text form at subscriber website www.questia.com. In 2008 and 2009, all of these books were republished by Kessinger Publishing and Bibliolife Publishing in hardcover and paperback. The title, Genesis of Art Form, is also accessible for free at www.aesthetics.cc Personal Life. Raymond was the son of Benjamin Wright Raymond, twice mayor of Chicago. He was educated at Phillips Academy, Andover, graduating in 1858, and Williams College where he was a member of the Kappa Alpha Society. He married Mary Elizabeth Blake in 1872, to see his New York Times obituary, http colon slash slash www.aesthetics.cc slash articles slash Raymond percent 20 dash percent 20 obituary percent 20 in percent 29 percent 2019 pdf bibliography. All works are published by G.P. Putnam's Sons, New York. This is only a list of his Raymond's works on aesthetics. 1886 Poetry as a Representative Art 1893 Genesis of Art Form HTTP colon slash slash www.aesthetics.cc slash articles slash nighttimes underscore review underscore genesis dot html 1894 Art in Theory 1894 Rhythm and Harmony in Poetry and Music Music as a Representative Art 1895 Painting, Sculpture and Architecture as Representative Arts 1899 Proportion and Harmony of Line and Color in Painting, Sculpture and Architecture 1900 Representative Significance of Form 1906 Essentials of Aesthetics Summary Textbook of First Seven Volumes 1920 An Art Philosopher's Cabinet edited by Marion Mills Miller